Hey, this is Dave from Unipro, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to earn money using Facebook Stars. Now, Facebook Stars is a relatively new feature on Facebook that allows content creators to get paid simply for creating content. So if you're already creating content on Facebook, this is something you might wanna look at. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to turn on Facebook Stars for your Facebook account, how to apply it to any video content that you create, and then how to encourage your audience to pay you, to thank you by giving you Facebook Stars. All that's included inside this video, so let's dive in. So if you're already on Facebook and you're already creating content, then it makes sense to get paid for that content. And right now, chances are you're probably creating a lot of content and not getting paid. That's no good. And maybe you've heard about Facebook stars, but you're not sure exactly how it works. Or you're not sure if it's worth actually setting up. And maybe people have told you, you know, Facebook isn't a good platform for monetizing your video content. Just stick to YouTube or stick to TikTok. And I'm here to tell you the Facebook stars program is actually very user friendly. It's very easy to set up. I'm going to walk you through all the steps right now. So I'm going to head over to my Facebook personal profile. Now, when you're using Facebook stars, you have a choice. You can either do it through your Facebook personal profile if you have professional mode turned on. If you're not sure about Facebook's professional mode, I'll put a link in the description of this video. I did a whole video covering what it is, how it works, and how you can use it. So you need to have professional mode if you're gonna be doing this through your personal profile. The other option is to do this through your business page. I'm gonna be doing it through my personal profile. So you can see here, I'm on my personal profile. And then when you have professional mode turned on, you're gonna see this here, view tools. And when you click on that, it's gonna take you over to your professional dashboard. And in here, under the tools section, Section, you may see something called monetization. And now when you're looking here, I'm on my desktop, obviously, you'll notice there isn't a monetization option. For me, I had to go over to my mobile phone. And so just as Facebook rolls out professional mode, it's clear that it's still adding features in different locations. And so if you don't see monetization here, I'll show you, I took a screenshot of what I saw on my mobile phone. So here's a screenshot. There was three pages that I had to click through. When I went into my professional dashboard on mobile, this is what I saw. And then you can see when you scroll down here to the bottom, you'll see monetization. And so I just clicked on that and then it took me over to my available tools for monetization. And you can see that stars is listed here. I clicked on that and then there's an option just to turn on stars. When you do that, when you turn on stars, you're going to get access to a bunch of options, a bunch of training, a bunch of tutorials, a bunch of resources here that help you monetize with stars. And that's really all you need to do. And so now you're set up, you're actually going to get an email that looks something like this. You get a congratulations saying you're ready to start earning money on Facebook. So this is pretty exciting. Well, now the question is, what do we do with this? What do we do with this? So I'm going to give you an example here. I'm going to go back over to my personal profile here and just imagine that you are going to do a live stream through your professional mode on personal profile, or again, this can work on your business page. Here's all I need to do is I'm going to click on live video and I'm going to say that I want to go live right now. I'm going to select that. And then it's going to take us over to the settings for this live video. Now, do you have to do live video in order to get stars in order to get paid? No, you can do it with pre-recorded video, but it's really helpful to do it with live video. And I'll show you why in just a second. When you're doing your setup, everything is just as normal here, but there is one new twist down here in the bottom left-hand corner. You'll notice that there's monetization. And so all I'm going to do is I'm going to click on that and a little drop down comes down here and it says stars. I'm going to click on stars. And then I'm going to click on enable. You can see I've already enabled it here. Probably the first time you do this, you're going to need to enable that. And what this does is this now allows your audience to give you stars for this piece of content that you're creating. And now the next obvious question is, well, how do you get them to do that? And the answer is simple. You just need to tell them. When you go live for the first time using stars, you're going to notice that Facebook over here in your dashboard, in your live video dashboard, it's going to give you some prompts to tell your audience in the comment section that you're using stars and to show them where they can go and get access to stars. So some of your audience, they might already have stars, but if not, Facebook makes it very easy for you to show them where to go in order to get stars to say thank you to you for the content you're creating. And there's a simple link you can simply follow. I'm just gonna to go to fb.com forward slash star. And I'm gonna click on that link and you'll see that it takes us over to a page that looks like this. And it gives a bunch of options for purchasing stars. So again, Facebook will prompt you to do this. You can drop this link over and over again in your comment section. It's really important that when someone does give you stars, pump them up, make a big deal about it. Hey, thanks, John. I just saw you sent me over 500 stars. That's amazing. I really appreciate you. If anyone else wants to send over some stars, here's where you can do it. I'll drop a link and then you can drop that link fb.com forward slash star. It'll take people over here. What people can do here is choose how many stars they want to purchase. When they're purchasing these stars, they're not saying that they're going to give it all to you. This just puts 
inputs the stars into their account and then they can decide where to give those stars out. And you'll see here, there's a bunch of different options for buying stars. You do get a better deal, so it gets cheaper per star as you buy more stars. In terms of how much these stars are actually worth when you give them out, every star that someone gives to you, or if you're giving stars to someone else, it earns them one cent. And I know you might hear that and just think, okay, that sounds like nothing. Facebook is really encouraging people to give out stars in batches. So they're probably gonna be giving you like 50 at a time or 500 at a time. So it does add up. Now you'll notice that in this case, I'll just use this one as an example here. You can see that you get in total 75 stars. If stars are worth one cent each, shouldn't the price be 75 cents? And you'll see the price over here is actually $1.33. And so you can see that Facebook is taking a fee in order to provide this service. And so if you take a look at all the different options here, you'll notice that again, that if you buy more stars, Facebook's fee percentage gets less and less. When you buy just 75 stars, I think Facebook's taking about 40% here, but Facebook's cut gets less as you buy more stars. So once someone comes over here and buys these stars, I'll just click on this one as an example. You'll see it'll take me over to a checkout page. And it's really easy. All I do is click on pay and then those stars go in my account. I'm not going to do that because when I go back over here, you'll see I already have a balance of 75 stars for this demonstration. So you can think about where we've come so far. We enabled stars on your Facebook account. Now we're creating a piece of content. In this case, it's a live video. We turn stars on for this video. We've given your audience an easy way to go and get stars so they can reward you and say thank you. We're remembering that when people do pay you with stars, we're gonna really encourage them and encourage everyone else to get stars as well. Make it easy for your audience to participate, to thank you. Now the only thing left to do is perhaps describe to your audience how they actually give you their stars. Once they do this once, it's so easy, but the first time they may need some instructions. and so. I'll show you, I'm gonna go over to a live video. In this live video that I'm looking at right now, this just popped up, Facebook suggested this to me. This video is over, so I can go and actually give stars to this content creator, even after the live video has finished. So you can encourage people during your live video or they can do it afterwards. So here's how to do it. I'm gonna go down to the comment section here and you'll see that there's an icon here with a little star. And when I hover over that, it says, give stars. I'm gonna click on that and you're gonna see that Facebook gives a suggestion. Remember I said that Facebook encourages people to give stars in batches? So 50, 100, 200, I could put in a custom amount, but you can see Facebook is really encouraging viewers to say thank you to content creators. Content creators like yourself have been giving all this value. Facebook's saying, hey, support them, give them some stars. And you can see right now it goes all the way up to yeah, 10,000 and you can give them these little badges as well. So if you do some quick math, if someone gives you a $10,000 badge here, 10,000 stars, they're giving you a $100 donation. Not bad, right? And like I said, if anyone does that, make sure you make a big deal inside of your Facebook Live so that other people are encouraged to follow suit. And so now you've got an overview of how the Facebook Stars program works. The last remaining question is, is it worth the trouble of setting this up? And really that comes down to the volume of audience, the size of audience who you have watching your stuff, watching your Facebook Lives or watching your videos. I'm gonna go over into one of the Facebook groups that I run. This one's called Audience and Influence. It's all about building online businesses using Facebook. And you can see a live video that my wife and I did here. And this one had a thousand people who watched it, 759 comments. Now, we didn't have stars turned on for this particular video, but let's do some math together. Imagine you have a thousand viewers and only a small segment of those viewers actually reward you with stars. Let's just say it's only 10%. And let's say these people buy the minimum package, so they buy just 75 stars, and they give you those 75 stars. Well, in this case, that's $75 of donations through stars that come to you simply for creating a live video that you are already gonna create. Now, full transparency, you might wonder how do we get such a big audience watching our live videos? How do we get so much engagement? And the truth is we use a tool, it's called Unipro. And Unipro is amazing. It does all of our Facebook marketing for us. It goes out and finds leads, people who'd be interested in the content that we're creating. It nurtures those leads. It brings those people into our Facebook group and it helps us make sales. And so if you've never checked out Unipro before, you gotta check it out. Go over to unipro.com. I know you're gonna love it. It's been a game changer for us. That's what I've got for you in this video. If you have any questions about Facebook stars or about any of the strategies I shared today, go ahead and leave those in the comments. I'm happy to help out. If this video was helpful to you, if you found this to be valuable, just give it a like. That lets me know that you appreciate it. And if you haven't checked out Unipro, you really gotta do it. Go to unipro.com. Again, if you're running a business and you're using Facebook to find leads, to find customers, it's a no-brainer. Go check it out at unipro.com. That's what I've got for you in this video. I'll see you in the next video.